and a buzzard ram scoop. These two objects allow us to collect more fuel and more power. Very useful. And we will put one gun on it. One artillery gun. Long range. Fire. Uh, nope. Just scale the artillery down a bit. There we go. We're going to save that as DefSat and make some DefSats. Two DefSats on every planet. Looks like we're out of metal and electronics, so I will focus on them. God damn it. Fucking pirates. small cruiser fleet just to take care of them. These worlds have very little resources. If they get raided, it's not really a big issue. Well, I'm gonna put some farms down on this planet. farms. Well, let's do two farms and a spaceport. So our fleet has taken care of these pirates pretty well. Just the way prize and all of them there. The pirates will eventually flee like they did there. So that's good. I think all of our research is done, so I'll pause the game once again and put a little bit more into economics, uh, put some more into potion, more armor, four levels of general sciences, and some more in there. Primantics, energy sciences, chemistry. I need to put in a few hunch. Hunches, these ones limit, um, they open up new links, in turn new technologies. I want biology so uh, I can stop worrying about food for now. Planet's not producing anything, so let's give it two defense sats. More colonization. Look at those mini satellites. this little system and I am going to launch a few more scouts good enough militarized world, balanced world I don't need any more researched worlds I need more electronics worlds this one needs to become an economic world Uh, 
are there pirates again? There better not be pirates. Oh, it's a remaining destroyer. Okay, I died. That's good. I wanna find that guy who's uh who declared war on me. Yeah, these blue fox, where are they? Can't see him for now. It's a good thing. Looks like we're dead. Okay, so our armor is at a decent rate. Let's see what new model modules we've unlocked. Well, just a little bit. Yeah, everything looks fine for now. up and colonize another system. Generator and we need a thruster. Okay, there we go. I like to have a little internal repair bay so that I can repair my systems easily. Missic system. Ah, there we go. External mount. So, um, as you've noticed, space inside uh, the hull takes, well, space. External mounts let us mount things outside, but if they get shot, they can... They're basically the first layer that gets taken off during a uh, battle. So, um, say we put our weapons on external mounts, that means uh, our weapons won't take up any internal space, but they'll get blown up really easily. And then uh, after the weapons, our armors will be uh, blown up. Our armor will be blown up. So that might be a problem. I think I'll go with uh, getting internal ammo catches and external guns for now. Uh, engines, we already have engines. Uh, what else do we need? Air tool, repair ships. Okay. Well, I will put four of these little buzzard ram scoops. They draw fuel from the surrounding space, so that should be pretty helpful. And analyzers, ammo catch. Yeah, we'll catch. We need a few of these. Two ammo catches placed right next to our bridge, so if the crew fucks up, they're all dead. Just like that. Yeah, I'll give them four more. Two more. There we go. So we have a nice stockpile of ammo when uh, we need the time, when the time comes. Small internally mounted guns and bigger guns on top. Let's see how much HP we get with this thing. Right now. 
points. One one that's decent. Yeah, I'll keep it like that. Ablative armor, it's just small padded armor. Stops light bullets from going into the ship. That'll be useful. Now external mounts. We can mount the engine outside. Okay, I see. So we mount them on bigger modules. Uh, we'll mount the engine outside, I guess. If it gets broken down, I mean, it's like we have the internal repair bay, so we should be fine. What is our repair rate? Yeah, that's decent. Save that, and let's begin production. You know what, I think I'll build a second ship as well. Called Ammo Hulk. And make it size 20. Why? Because it is just gonna be a literal giant pile of ammunition that is floating in space. The simplest way to um, supply your troops with ammunition is to just build a giant ammo pile outside in space. Kind of like a giant storage container in my opinion. And we are just going to load this thing up. Like that. more ammunition and now with the external mounts set it up so that it barely uses anything AI settings let's go here automation orders fetch fuel fetch ammo supply resource supply resource ammunition percentage 25 set save there we go Maybe we should also do that for our uh, last one frigate. Here's uh, fetch ammo, fetch for defense system. Yes, it's all good. All right, going back to colonization. We'll build one ammo hulk for now. Built a few class one frigates. Keep our planet safe. Looks like we have a new treaty. No. 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 Right now we're last in military well, not anymore military and colonization. And that's what I really want to get ahead in. Or else the AI will kind of bully you into uh, wars and stuff, stuff. I want a decent sized amount of ships to fight with. Are we at war with these guys already? No? Okay, good. And we were low in economic, you can, uh, eh. Advanced parts, I'm saying economic parts for some reason. Shady waiting. No. Let's see what planets we have here. Research world, farm world, no metal mining. 